Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, a change is coming in April for the Windows updates. Uh, they'll be a little more predictable and what I mean by that is especially for the uh, bug fixes update or what we call the preview release. Um, so of course every month in Windows we have two types of updates. We have the Patch Tuesday updates and those are regular. We know when they arrive. It's always the second Tuesday of every month. So that's, you know, the the known update. We know when it's going to be there. Uh, but in April, uh, what's going to change is the C-band update, or what we call, they call them the preview release, but they are really bug fixes for Windows. That was always the second update that would uh, arrive every month. Now, that one was not, you know, always on the same time. It was sometimes the third week of the month. Sometimes it was the fourth week of the month. We didn't really know exactly when it was going to be there. Well, now starting in April, Microsoft says that the preview updates that are available for Windows for bug fixes will always be on the fourth week of every month. So now we know that's the fourth week all the time that it's going to be there. They say it's to have a better updates and to make sure that, you know, they are probably better and and probably have a little more time for uh you know the uh the uh, checking to make sure they have no bugs and and you know testing phase of, of of all of it and you know they say that having a more accurate time frame will also help in the deployment of windows updates apparently so f now we know that second tuesday of the month is patch tuesday security updates and the fourth week of the month will always be the bug fixes or the preview release as they call them which are bug fixes for windows also remember that this month march is the last bug fixing update for windows 10 21 h2 if you're still on 21 h2 uh, time to move on as the uh, 21 h2 uh, will expire sometime in june or may or june of this year so you don't have a lot of time left and there are going to be no more bug fixes for that version so only Windows 10 22H2 now will continue having the bug fixes every month on the fourth week. And, uh, of course, Windows 11 and Windows 11 22H2 will continue getting um, 21H2, 22H2 on, tw on Windows 11 will continue getting the bug fixes for the rest of the year. Um, or, you know, until Windows 11 21H2 expires at the end of the year at least. So that's uh, what we know and what changes are coming. Uh, a little more accurate time frame that we'll know when, uh, f especially the bug fixes, the release preview will arrive. If, or the preview release, sorry. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.